family hiking, sightseeing, enjoying Acadia. We've parked over by Sand Beach and we're gonna do the Bowl Trail. We'll go up the backside of a Beehive. So we're starting out here on the Bowl Trail, which also starts out on Beehive. This is nice. It feels like we have the trail to ourselves. Oh look, you can see people going up Beehive. That is so cool. Look at people going up the front face of Beehive. You wanna do that, Sarah? to the bowl. It actually was a pretty easy, I'm looking at my clock here, under a half hour with a young child. There's the young child. <laughs> so it was a leisurely pace. She's a little tired from Gorham Trail yesterday, I think. Really pretty here this morning and not crowded. I'd have to say this was a pretty I don't want to say steep, but it was uphill all the way until it was downhill at the end when you knew you were coming to the bowl. I like it though. Pretty view. Very pretty. I love all the different views of nature you can have here at Acadia with tranquility. This is just another view of the bowl. So pretty. Look at that. Do you think this view is pretty? Coming up the backside of Beehive. My bad, we're not near the top of Beehive. We're across from it on another little plateau. Wow, I really need to learn my geography. It's really pretty. So that's Beehive. The top is over there. Or the summit. Yeah, it's definitely a little warmer today. Very pretty over here though. We are Coming up on the summit, I think, soon. Very rocky. We took the back side up. Still gorgeous, still get the view. It's great, a little warm, a little humid actually. Maybe it's just me sweating. But very pretty. Nice look back that way. Which... So here we are at the top of Beehive. A lot of people behind us. Oh no, oh. Oh, and there goes the kid too. <laughs> Good save. <laughs> so we're just hanging out here at the top of Beehive. So we're just having a little snack. Beautiful views. I hear these are the porcupine islands we're looking at. A little more time here at the summit and then we're gonna go back down. Also, while we were at the summit, we saw two plastic water bottles roll down the hill. Watch out for water bottles rolling down the hill here. <laughs> yeah, definitely got to watch out for water bottles rolling down the hill. We are making our way down the backside of Beehive. So even though we've been to the summit, going up the front side is still on the to-do list. All right, Sarah, we have 0.6 miles. That's like walking around half our neighborhood. So we just came down all these boulders and back in the shade, yay. Sarah, you're doing awesome. We are making our way back to the car. We've got a half mile back to Sand Beach. Going down the stairs, so pretty in here. We had a bottle rolling off the top of Beehive incident. And while moments earlier, a boy had used his lightning quick reflexes to secure his from rolling off the hill. My wife and I watched as Sarah's just went rolling down the hill. I'm lucky my wife decided not to chase it. There's my daughter. My daughter is very sad that she lost her water bottle. The 
This is just a great view of watching people go up the front face of Beehive. We did it. We did Bull Trail, backside up Beehive. It was good, but we had a good time. I think our daughter's a little tired. Do you have napkins or anything? It's all in the bag. Okay. All right, got our Sammies. Gonna walk on down to the boat ride. Do you have our drink? It's a warm day here. It's gonna be a nice day on the boat, that's for sure. We can find a park bench. So we're gonna eat lunch right here, and then we're gonna get on that. I had the Thanksgiving day after sandwich from the Down East Deli, it was very good. I was also very hungry, but it was good. We're gonna board the boat now. We're about to get on the Margaret Todd. boarding the Margaret Todd. See the gray seal. So that was it. That was the uh, Margaret Todd. Had a very pleasant ride. Sleep inducing pleasantness to it. It was nice, breeze felt good. Got to see Acadia from the, the ocean view. You can walk across a sandbar here in Bar Harbor. So we're gonna check it out. I don't think we're gonna walk the whole thing. We'll go check it out. We might find sea glass. You might find sea star. Don't get stranded. Definitely don't get stranded. I think I know how Moses felt. <laughs> I'm gonna feel the water. So it's low tide, and if you're not careful, you'll be stranded or in the water, worse yet. It's a nice afternoon, breeze feels good. So low tide here, Frenchman's Bay. You can walk out to that island. We're not gonna walk out to the island. We're just strolling out here, checking it out. They need benches out here. Just a place to sit, a couple benches. Just anchor them, bolt them to the floor. Some benches. I'm looking at seashells on the seashore floor. My daughter looks like she's having a good time. I was standing right about there and then I got a job offer while on vacation. Just a little tidbit there, thought I'd share. So we uh, did the path for a little bit. We're walking back through town. What a beautiful night. Got some pizza. I thought we were gonna do the outdoor pool, but um, it's a little chilly out. We're in the indoor pool now, as you can see. We've had a full day. 7 p.m. Got our pizza to go. Ate it in the uh, eating area at the Hampton Inn. I want to do a Jacuzzi, ending our day at the Jacuzzi. <laughs>